Hi everyone! In this tutorial, we are going to scrap YouTube information details, titles, views, and thumbnails of a given channel using Selenium. First, you need to install Selenium by using pip install Selenium. Second, you need to install Chrome driver. You simply write Chrome driver download go to this link and download the right version then you will place the chrome driver in the same folder as the jupyter notebook or the python script you are using first we will import web driver from selenium we will import time and pandas as pd we will set the driver using webdriver.chrome and we will copy and paste the path of the chrome driver. In this case, the chrome driver is in the same folder, so we will write only the name of the chrome driver file. We need to specify the URL of the YouTube channel we are going to scrap. In this video, I will choose three blue one brown channel we will copy and paste this url the next function is to scroll down to the bottom of the page to load all the videos if we did not use this function the code will scrap only the first videos and not all the videos of the page first we will get the scroll height of the page by using driver.executescript while true we will scroll down to the bottom and then put pause the selenium for three seconds and then we will compare the new scroll height to the last scroll height if they are equal so we reach the bottom of the page if not we will repeat again the function from the beginning after we loaded the whole page, now we will scrap the titles using the ID and views and images using XPath. To copy the XPath, we go to the element and click Inspect and then copy the XPath. For the titles, I added the full path so we can get all the images of the thumbnails. I will add those information into a list and then create a data frame of three columns title, views, and thumbnails and then df to csv to save the file as csv and then we will close the chrome tab by using driver.quit then you will find the CSV file on the same folder as the Jupyter Notebook and the Chrome driver. Now let's run our script. As you see, a new tab is opened. And now, Selenium is scrolling down to the bottom automatically. And then, the tab will be closed automatically also. And in the same folder, we will find the CSV file. 